NASA's Explorer 1 shuttle, the outermost voyaging shuttle ever launched, proceeds with its amazing excursion through the universe for almost 50 years. Explorer 1 has been sending back essential data from the farthest reaches of the universe, altogether propelling our comprehension of the universe. However, recent transmissions from this astounding rocket have introduced confounding signs that have left the whole space community in a state of wonderment and bewilderment. These signs have started debates about whether they are the consequence of a technical error or if they could be indicative of something undeniably more extraordinary, such as extraterrestrial activity. Join us as we dive further into the mystery surrounding these noteworthy transmissions and uncover what may be hiding in the depths of space. Humankind's interest with the secrets beyond our planet has been a driving force in space exploration since its inception. This voracious curiosity led to the notable launch of missions like Explorer 1 and Voyager 2, which were among the most ambitious space efforts of their time. The launch of Voyager 2 from NASA's Kennedy Space Center on August 21, 1977, marked the start of a new era in space exploration. Only 14 days later, on September 5, Voyager 1 followed, making way for an exceptional journey. These twin spacecraft, each weighing around 720 kilograms, roughly the size of a small car, were launched during a rare alignment of the outer planets, which played a crucial role in their trajectories and mission results. Throughout their amazing odyssey, these shuttles traveled in different directions and at varying speeds. A critical moment occurred on December 15, 1977, when Voyager 1 overtook its twin due to differences in their paths. Since then, Voyager 1 has emerged as a vital resource, providing significant data that has revolutionized our understanding of the universe and its many peculiarities. Before we delve into Voyager 1's most recent astonishing discovery, which has captured the attention of the entire space community, we should look back at some of its most significant accomplishments. In 1978, during its Jovian imaging mission, Voyager 1 was positioned about 265 million kilometers from Earth. By January 1979, it had embarked on an incredible 100-hour mission, capturing a fascinating time-lapse film of Jupiter's rotation. This series of 3,750 images offered remarkable views of Jupiter's dynamic atmosphere and its complex features. The spacecraft's discoveries included the identification of a small ring around Jupiter and two previously unknown moons, greatly expanding our knowledge of the gas giant's intricate system. To ensure the spacecraft's safe passage and avoid potential impacts with Titan, one of Saturn's moons, corrective maneuvers were executed. After the successful Saturn mission, scientists decided to conclude the planetary mission of both Voyager 1 and Voyager 2. However, the spacecraft were redirected on a new path beyond the boundaries of our solar system, traveling at an astonishing speed of 325 million kilometers per year. In January 1990, the interstellar mission began with Voyager 1 continuing its divine journey. During this period, Voyager 1 made significant discoveries, including the identification of four additional moons, Mimas, Enceladus, Tethys, and Rhea, and captured some of the most iconic images ever taken of our solar system. On February 14, 1990, Voyager 1, located approximately 6 billion kilometers from the Sun, embarked on a visual journey known as the family portrait, capturing stunning images of the planets of the solar system. This collection of 60 pictures added to Voyager 1's impressive series of 670 photographs taken during its encounter with Neptune. Voyager 2 also achieved remarkable milestones during its mission. As it approached Neptune, it recorded wind speeds surpassing 13,100 meters per second, the fastest winds ever observed in our solar system. This achievement provided valuable insights into Neptune's distant atmosphere and its largest moon, Triton's surface temperature, which plummeted to a frigid minus 391 degrees Fahrenheit, making it one of the coldest places in our solar system. Triton also exhibited unusual features, including ice volcanoes that erupted nitrogen gas and hurled frozen particles five kilometers into its thick atmosphere. These extraordinary discoveries have expanded our understanding of the diverse and complex nature of celestial objects in the farthest regions of our solar system. The Voyager missions have delivered groundbreaking results. Voyager 1 and Voyager 2 revealed that the moons of Jupiter and Saturn, once thought to be heavily scarred and dormant, 
are actually teeming with geological activity. Voyager 2, in particular, achieved several notable milestones, including being the first spacecraft to fly by Uranus and Neptune. NASA employed various strategies to extend the operational lifespan of these ambitious spacecraft, including shutting down non-essential radiators and systems to conserve energy. The mission is expected to conclude in 2030, marking a moment of pride and a hint of melancholy for the scientists and engineers who have devoted themselves to this extraordinary endeavor. The design of Voyager 1 and Voyager 2 was a marvel of engineering. These spacecraft were designed as stable platforms, rotating at a rate more than 10 times slower than a clock's hour hand. This design choice reduced visual blurring as the spacecraft crossed the vast expanse of space. Even before reaching the outer planets, the spacecraft began transmitting images of Jupiter, revealing its swirling clouds and famous features. The Great Red Spot, a massive storm on Jupiter, fascinated audiences at NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory. However, the discovery of active volcanoes on Jupiter's moon Io garnered the most attention. The spacecraft's instruments detected unusual signals from Io, which were confirmed by detailed images showing towering volcanic plumes and a surface scarred by eruptions. One of Io's most prominent volcanoes erupted with a force 100 times greater than that of Mount St. Helens, covering an area nearly the size of France. As the spacecraft continued their journey, their cameras were eventually turned off to preserve power and memory before they ventured into interstellar space. Notably, the images they captured did not include Mercury or Mars, due to various factors. Beyond the Voyager missions, NASA has launched other notable spacecraft including Voyager 10, Voyager 11, and New Horizons. On February 17, 1998, Voyager 10 surpassed Voyager 11, becoming the spacecraft farthest from Earth. Despite the absence of other space probes to observe it, Voyager 1 continued its solitary journey for 14 more years before entering interstellar space on August 25, 2012. The success of the Voyager missions was made possible through various innovative methods, with gravity assist maneuvers standing out as especially brilliant. These maneuvers were crucial for propelling the spacecraft to their distant targets and gathering important data. The spacecraft relied not only on their own propulsion systems but also on gravity assists to achieve their goals. Imagine the two brave rockets smoothly navigating through our solar system, using the gravitational pull of planets to propel themselves forward. This celestial dance allowed them to conserve fuel and achieve the necessary speeds to visit multiple locations. Gravity assist maneuvers involve providing the spacecraft with a small amount of a planet's energy as it passes by with extreme precision. For example, as Voyager 1 approached Jupiter, the planet's immense gravitational attraction accelerated the spacecraft, increasing its speed. Achieving such accuracy was crucial, as any deviation from the correct angle or speed could have resulted in disastrous outcomes. Despite the overwhelming precision required, the brilliant minds behind these missions successfully executed these gravity assists on numerous occasions, sending the spacecraft on an extraordinary journey. The magnificent voyage made possible by these gravity assist maneuvers saw Voyager 2 using gravity assists from Jupiter and Saturn to reach Uranus and Neptune. The success of the Voyager missions owes much to these gravity assists. As we reflect on the incredible journey of these exploring spacecraft and the wealth of data they have provided, we eagerly await further updates on the investigation into Voyager 1's new anomalies. Both Voyager 1 and Voyager 2 continue their missions beyond the natural limits of our solar system, and their achievements include Jupiter and its moons, Saturn and its moons, Uranus, and Neptune. Voyager 1's time-lapse pictures capture 10 rotations of Jupiter in clear detail, including the discovery of new moons and a small ring. These discoveries have greatly enhanced our understanding of Jupiter's complex system. Voyager 1 also discovered four additional moons of Saturn, Mimas, Enceladus, Tethys, and Rhea, and took remarkable photos of Saturn and its rings, providing new insights into Saturn's intricate system. The spacecraft made history by visiting Uranus and Neptune and delivering valuable data about their atmospheres and moons, deepening our understanding of the farthest regions of our solar system. After completing their planetary missions, Voyager 1 and Voyager 2 ventured into interstellar space gathering information on the vast environment. 
This ongoing investigation continues to expand our knowledge of the universe beyond our solar system. As we await more information about Voyager 1's latest signals and their possible implications for our understanding of the universe, the remarkable journey of the spacecraft remains a source of inspiration and curiosity for scientists and space enthusiasts alike. Their historic achievements continue to push the boundaries of human knowledge and exploration, showcasing the vast potential of space discovery. The Voyager missions have provided us with a treasure trove of data about our solar system and beyond. Beyond the remarkable images and information, the spacecraft have also carried a special artifact, a golden record designed to convey the story of our world to extraterrestrials. This record contains sounds and images intended to depict the diversity of life and culture on Earth. It includes greetings in 55 languages, music from various cultures, and a selection of natural sounds, such as thunder and whale songs. This message in a bottle, so to speak, reflects the hope that one day, if intelligent life exists elsewhere, they may find and understand it, offering a glimpse into humanity's essence. Explorer 1 and Explorer 2 were equipped with scientific instruments that have transformed our understanding. These instruments included magnetometers, plasma wave detectors, astronomical ray instruments, and imaging systems, each contributing essential data about space phenomena. For example, the magnetometers have provided insights into the magnetic fields of Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune, revealing the complex interactions between these planets and their surroundings. The plasma wave detectors helped us understand the nature of the solar wind and its interaction with planetary atmospheres and magnetospheres. One of the most significant aspects of the Voyager missions is their ability to measure the heliosphere boundary a massive bubble of solar particles and magnetic fields that encloses our solar system. As Voyager 1 approached the edge of this boundary, it detected the sudden transition from the solar wind to the interstellar medium. This data has been instrumental in shaping our understanding of the heliosphere structure and its role in protecting Earth from cosmic radiation. The spacecraft's observations have provided evidence of a distinct boundary where the solar wind slows down and becomes denser, known as the termination shock. Beyond this point lies the helio sheath, a region where the solar wind interacts with the interstellar medium, creating a complex and dynamic environment. Voyager 2's journey has been equally significant. After its successful flybys of Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune, it has continued to provide valuable information about the outer reaches of our solar system. Voyager 2's observations of Uranus were particularly noteworthy for revealing its unusual magnetic field which is tilted significantly compared to the planet's rotation axis. This discovery challenged existing models of planetary magnetism and sparked further investigation into the magnetic conditions of other celestial bodies. In addition to their scientific contributions, the Voyager missions have had a profound impact on public interest in space exploration. The stunning images of distant planets and their moons, coupled with the personal stories of the spacecraft's journey, have captured the imagination of people around the world. The images of Saturn's rings and the detailed views of Jupiter's moons, particularly Io's volcanic activity, have inspired countless individuals and have been featured in educational materials, documentaries, and popular media. These missions have fostered a sense of wonder and curiosity about the universe, emphasizing the importance of exploration and the quest for knowledge. The engineering and logistical achievements accomplished by the Voyager missions are also noteworthy. The spacecraft were designed to operate in extreme conditions far from Earth, with temperatures dipping below minus 220 degrees Celsius. They relied on radioisotope thermoelectric generators, RTGs, for power, providing a reliable energy source despite the vast distance from the Sun. The engineers who designed and built these spacecraft faced numerous challenges including ensuring that the instruments would remain operational for many years and that communication could be maintained over such enormous distances. The data returned by the explorers has also influenced our understanding of the broader cosmic environment. The spacecraft have helped map the distribution of cosmic rays and have provided insights into the density and composition of interstellar dust. This information is crucial for understanding the conditions in the space between stars and for planning future missions that could explore other star systems. As the explorers continue their journey into interstellar space, 
their legacy is established not only by the data they have already provided, but also by the inspiration they offer for future exploration. The missions have paved the way for new technologies and techniques in space science and have set a precedent for ambitious long-term space missions. They demonstrate the possibilities of human ingenuity and the value of perseverance in the face of daunting challenges. Looking forward, the Voyager missions have inspired a new generation of spacecraft and mission concepts. Future missions are being designed to build upon the success of the Voyager program, with the goal of exploring even more distant regions of space. These upcoming missions will continue to push the boundaries of our knowledge and will benefit from the foundations laid by the Voyager spacecraft. In conclusion, the Voyager missions represent one of humankind's greatest achievements in space exploration. Their contributions to science, their role in advancing our understanding of the solar system and beyond, and their impact on public imagination highlight the importance of continued exploration and curiosity. As Voyager 1 and Voyager 2 travel further into the universe, they remain symbols of human ambition and the eternal quest for knowledge.